Good afternoon and welcome to the Mike Show for Monday, May 4th, 2020. It is 45 degrees at about 1.57 p.m. Sunny out there, but pretty chilly and windy. Look at that chime blowing around out there. Oh, I just came home from a, a bike ride and a shopping excursion, and we got a bunch going on. We stopped at the cemetery and picked up some firewood on the way home, but before that we stopped at Meyer uh, and got a few groceries, which I'm getting ahead and behind myself at the same time, but we're here with our loves now, and let's show you some of them. Hey, look, at there's Melsey. There's my Elsie. There's my sweet Elsie. There's my little Samuel. Look at that beautiful soul. Yeah, look at that lady. I love you, Ross. And, uh, Mackie's over here in his rocking chair. This is where he likes to spend the afternoons, especially when the sun's shining in. I wanted to show you right now, I am sporting my, uh, I'm essential, save a lot shirt. I don't know what I'm essential about. I'm essentially an asshole, but hey, you know, that's another story altogether. But no, I had a pretty good day. Uh, got up real early this morning. I think we were up around 6.15. And right now we're going to make some electric coffee. We got 8 ounces of espresso right there. There's a half teaspoon of sugar in there. Sugar in the raw. And this is how we make our electric coffee. We pour that in there. Then we take that fill it with ice cubes. I'm all over the place partly because I, I'm kind of bonking. I need to eat something. I had a good break there. So then we just fill that up with ice cubes. Maybe take seven or eight or nine. I don't know. And then you take a splash of whip, or, uh, heavy whipping cream. Shake it up real good. None of that pissing around stuff. Not milk, not half and half. Get some real fucking heavy cream. Splash of that. Eh, maybe a touch more. And then you just kind of let that melt and ooze together and you got electric coffee, as I call it. One time I told somebody I worked with at the Friendship Room how I made my iced coffees, and uh, which I call the electric coffee. And he said... Uh, why don't you just chew the beans? <laughs> so anyway, while I'm thinking about it, we drove the truck to Meyer because I think in a previous video to the 7.5 billion of you who never tune in or don't tune in, uh, we're fucked out of getting into Norway Ridge from the Tamrack Road by uh, ignorant assholes, self-absorbing assholes who violated uh, an agreement and a trust with the landowners to use their easement to get there. So anyway, it's a long, lot longer to get out to the trail. It sucks going out there that way. So, And it was pretty cold and windy this morning, so I drove to Meyer and pedaled from there. So, oh, did that fail? The truck's parked right there. There's the truck. You can see my sete in the back of it, and there's some firewood we scored at the cemetery on the way home. And we're not going to burn all that up tonight. No way, but... And at Meyer, we uh, picked up some feline greenies for the loves, some Irish butter. It's not the kind we usually like to get. We like the uh, Greenfields butter, but we got two flavors of them, and we're going to try those out for the loves because they've never had them before. And before I purchase a, a great big container of them, I want to make sure they're going to eat those. Got some uh, hard salami here. We're going to grill some of our toast, put some Swiss cheese and mustard, and make sandwiches with that. And uh, this cheese right here is some raw, sharp cheddar made with unpasteurized milk. It's a good treat to have now and then, so we'll throw that in the refrigerator now. I got some Swiss in here somewhere. Oh, boy. I don't know if I'll be able to stand back up after squatting down. But, yeah, we had a great ride at Norway Ridge. These are some great treats, too. I like eating these, these little mini peppers. So they pop in potato chips in your mouth. You just can't stop doing it. All right, I thought I had some sliced cheese in here. Oh, we cooked some beans to make some salsa with. We'll be doing that later on today. Where is that fucking cheese? There it is, there's the Swiss cheese. I'm full of profanity right now, aren't I? So yeah, we had a good coffee and wake up time. Look at all that's melting down in there. It's almost abstract art. 
Uh, there's some bread sliced for the sandwiches we're going to make. The pan's heated up. So anyway, Mikey's downstairs. Look at, there's Nelsie. Where are you going, Nelsie? You going to go through? You going through, hon? You want to go outside? Alright, anyway. So, I'm going to pause and get that sandwich going. Look at Tammy. He's having something to eat. Uh... We've been watching Classic Mike Show, too, from when it was started back in May of 2017. I believe May 17th was the first day, and we're going to put that back on and hang out here with our loves and watch some more of it. Autumn was in there, Sagey, Joey, all my loves. And it, uh, while I was gone, the whole, the whole playlist played. But I recommend it. You can go back and watch these playlists and see how I was so positive and full of hope way back then. And, you know, life was real good. And then I just slowly got broken into pieces, you know, losing all my loves and all the bullshit that happened. And one thing after another, if you go back to the first early episodes, and it'd take you quite a while, I'm sure, to watch them all from 2017. But, uh,. You'll really see how much I degenerate over the years. Fall apart phys physically, mentally, emotionally, and spiritually. Look at that, Sammy. I love you, baby. But anyway, Mikey came up now. Let's go see Mikey. There's Elsie. Hey, there's me and Audie. That's the very first Mike show. Beautiful May 17th, Wednesday morning. Birds singing. Smells good, the leaves are popping off the trees, the buds are turning into leaves. Sun is rising, it's supposed to be 84 degrees today. Look at Audie. Got a food demo at Meyer. Anyhow, and I just mentioned on that one how buds are starting to pop, and they are happening out there, a lot of color happening, a lot of flowers blooming outside. The leaves are starting to grow. And, uh, yeah, it's going to be nice to have a sandwich, drink some of that electric coffee, and take a break. Uh, a couple things that happened yesterday. The panic's in again. We're out of canned mushrooms at the store, and uh, so in this one woman's mind, we had no food in the store. Everything's gone. And I said, ma'am, excuse me, but there's food all over here, and we have fresh mushrooms. And she just looked at me like I was speaking Greek. But... There was no food in the store. There's none anywhere. This her exact words, and there was a lot of that. No chicken. There's no. There's no meat in your cooler. It's empty, and the thing was just full. But anyway, I don't want to get into that crap too much, and uh, I'm gonna pause for a second. So anyway, we're back, and I ran into somebody out. Uh, boy, am I all over the place. Sugar spiking and dropping and whatnot. But uh, I ran into somebody I often see out at the ridge. He used to go jogging out there with his dog, and sometimes I'd see him riding his bike. And he was looking for the the new way in through the back way because he too was disappointed that he couldn't get in the regular ways. But we had a great chat, and this leads back to the COVID thing. And he's of like mind like me, and he's a numbers guy. And he said, you know, it's just basically much ado about nothing despite the fact, yes, I know people's loved ones are dying, but do the math, people. If it was as bad as they say it is, there'd be dead bodies all over the streets, you know? They're just doing nothing but pushing gloom, doom, and panic, and people are just terrified and sucking it up. But anyway, all right, so here we go. Got some of our homemade mayo there, and we're going to take this. Slap it in there. Listen. Oh, that's going to brown up good. Throwing some Swiss cheese on there. Then we're going to put some mustard and salami and chow down. Our coffee's getting there. And that's all we have right now. So, hey, have a happy Monday. Thanks for not tuning in.